for that, don't you think? <laughs> it is, it, well, it's, it has been snowing a lot of places. And he's gone. Live, live television, everyone. He'll he'll be back. They always they always come back. I think so. No, it Discord decided to reset itself. Yeah, di okay, yeah, Discord was angry. Discord was very angry. Alright. Discord. And he's gone. <laughs> Did you change out the hamster on your modem? Yeah, I don't know what's happening. You keep flickering on and off. Whatever settings you're messing with, stop it. <laughs> I'm not doing this, you just press turn on camera, and then everything freezes. Okay, it seems to be stable. That's stable. OBS crash, that was the issue. Do not press the big shiny red button, that whatever you do. Just don't do that. Since when did I have Eric on the computer? OBS really doesn't like me. Are you, are you still trying to go live? Yeah, OBS crashed. My computer really doesn't like me at all. Oh, man, your your poor little potato net. I know, right? It's normally not this bad. It just doesn't like you. Like what? I don't understand. It's only ever when I talk to you. First time, our first board game stream, <laughs> and this happens. I'm being hacked. That's what. That's what's happening. You're hacking me. Absolutely, it, it's a DDoS from the the board game society. Well, I've I've heard that the developer doesn't actually the developer of um of Oceans supposedly doesn't like Tabletop Simulator. He thinks it's like, um, it, it's one of those old fogey things where he thinks it's killing the hobby, but in in reality, it, he he just doesn't like it because you know people can try out his game and not pay him for it. Yeah, I do understand where he's coming from partly when he says you know it's killing the hobby. I get that, because I do understand you know what he means by it, but at the same time, it's just not though. Well, it's, in my opinion, it's not true because I can point at so many different games that have a thriving community only because there are virtual ways to play it. Blood Bowl is the prime example. There are whole underground rings of Blood Bowl players. Very popular game. Um, there's a website called Fumble where you can play it um, on your browser, and that's very popular. And uh, I remind you, Blood Bowl is a uh, Games Workshop property. The last people you'd think that would be okay with people just playing their content for free. Yeah, that is very true. Alright, so that's step one of setting the stream back up. Getting my face off the stream. Twice. There you go. Now I have you on the stream. Woohoo. Oh, it's popular. Okay. So you're not as big as the game. Tabletop is on the screen. It's not everything. Desktop audio, are you working? Say something. Say something. 
Yes. Yes. Everything is going according to plan. Stream. Please stream. Please don't crash. That's Excellent. Please. How many times have I joined your damn game now? Too many. It's loading in assets for your game. That's good. Stream is started. I'm going okay. I'm going to. I can sit on the same side as you. Oh, shit. Go, right. go go, sit in blue, because I, I put your little score token in blue. Oh, sure. You're no. banished! No. You're not allowed on this side! This is the cool... This is the cool side of the table, with the cool people. Oh, whoops. How do I... How do I undo that? Okay. I banish you to spectator, I banish you to blue. There you go. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Alright. This game's called Oceans. Wow, fish. Fish. So, Oceans takes place way a long time ago, in a distant past. Uh, during the uh, Cambrian Explosion, actually. Well, technically, it spans a period of time before the Cambrian Age, um, through the Cambrian Explosion. So, this... For the... We're, we're not actually like just rapidly evolving. This is this game is supposedly taking place over a very long period of time. And hold on, I need to to turn my cyberpunk techno a little down there. There we go. And so uh, I would like to direct you to this this giant this giant like standee that's kind of next to you that has all the cards on it. Um, there's also an aid like right next to you. And so what this displays is all of the different surface cards. That is to say everything in this big um, brightly colored deck uh, near the, the middle here, um, it's made up entirely of cards on this list because the surface represents everything that we know in science. This is everything that we can kind of um, observe in how fish have evolved in history. So you get stuff like filter feeders, apex predators, um, speed, tentacles, stuff like that. This is all uh, observable. And for the uh, first chunk of the game, these are the only kinds of cards we can actually play. Okay. And, um... So, how many cards are we grabbing here? Okay. So, uh... You can hover over this uh, this deck here, the surface cards deck here. If you just press six, it's gonna put six cards in your hand. Okay, so I hover over this thing and press six. Yep. There you go, you have six oh. cards. And uh, for the record, I cannot see those. When it's in this hand area, it's completely hidden. So I can't see your cards, you can't see my cards. I can do this though. Yeah, don't, oh, do see yeah, don't take my cards because then you can see them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, okay, so don't steal. Okay. Yeah, dude. Um, oh, hi Dom. Dom joined. Oh nice, Dom, Dom's checking, it, checking us out. Hi Dom, we're playing Oceans. He normally comes in and then fucks off. As He's one does. Him and stream elements. That's an upgrade from yesterday. Okay. 
I would I would flip the table, but I'm actually interested in this game. Yeah, let, let's get a little farther before we get there. <laughs> it, it will happen. <gasps> I should rename the stream to Table Flip Fridays. Oh boy. Okay. I'm gonna pick it up. So those are our surface cards, right? Now in the other, yeah. in the middle of the area, we have all of the fish. In the the reef here is affected by uh, the green number on cards. So for instance, um, filter feeders take five fish from the reef because they have a green stat of five. Green always means the reef. Okay. Uh, and then we get to the ocean. Uh, whenever you score a blue number, it comes from the ocean. So okay. filter feeders and uh, symbiotes, bottom feeders. Wait, yeah, I meant to say bottom feeders and symbiotes. They they primarily take from the ocean. And Isn't that what venom is? Symbiote? What's up? Yes, venom is a symbiote. Venom, that... Different kind of yeah. symbiote though. Oh, okay. So, though, no venom. In this game. Honestly, um, buddhistically, uh. The supervillain Venom is actually a parasite because a symbiote yeah, means a beneficial like relationship for both people. Venom's a one-sided relationship. Um, yeah, sure, sure, the kid true. gets superpowers, but Venom kind of wins in that deal. Uh, yeah, Venom is kind of killing them slowly. So, um, back to the game. So whenever you score a blue yeah. number, it comes from the ocean. And then there's red. Red is an attack. That's when I take fish from your game board and add it to my game board. Ooh. And during your turn, you do four things. The first thing you do is you play one of your cards. You can play one of your cards to evolve or create a species, or you can play it so that little number on the bottom is a migration. You can take that many fish from one area and put them in another. For instance, um, let's say I have a card that has a 10 on it. I can play that as a migration. I can take 10 of the fish from the very bottom of the ocean and I could plop them right in the reef if I wanted to. So that's playing cards. Next is feeding. That's where I pick one of my species and I have it feed from the board somehow. This is typically gonna be either a foraging or an attack. We'll get there. Next is aging, where every single species on your board, on your side of the board, will age one fish and that fish goes into your little score bag. Your little blue score bag here is where all your scored fish go from aging. And if you have the most fish at the end of the game, you win. Okay. And then at the end of the turn, you draw cards and make the decision of, do you want to draw from the deep cards? At the end of your turn, you get the decision, optionally, before you refill your hand with surface cards, you can either take one of the two deep cards on offer here, or you can take it from the deck. And I believe to do... Let me remember how to do that. Okay. To do that, you're gonna pull out three cards there and you use Alt Shift to peek at them. One goes to your hand and the other two go on the, the gene pools. We'll, we'll get there. Ah, uh, okay. Thanks, sir. I got you. Oh, that's right. It's night where you are. Yeah. I got coffee. Well, I prefer mine. I know, I like your I like yours Irish. 
Oh, they said you too. They said hi to you as well. Oh, hello all. Hello, oh, Flickering Starlight. Hello, Woyacht. Oh, wow, everyone's showing up, and I haven't even started kicking your ass yet. All right, well, I, I better get my turn started. My, my viewers are better than yours. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm going to just ignore I'm going to pretend you didn't say that. So, at the start of my turn, I'm going to play a card. And the only card that really makes sense here is... Hmm. Pre pre uh preemptive strike. I'm gonna play whale cleaner. And so I've created a species here. And on my turn, I am going to forage one fish and add it to my board. Now it's worth noting, even though I don't have a green or a red stat. Um, I automatically always have a 1-1. One, one. That is to say, this species, even though it doesn't have a stat, it always counts as one attack and one forage. So, a species can always eat. It's just, later on, that won't be enough. Okay. So, I, I foraged my one fish. I now age. So I'm going to take my one fish, and I put it in my happy score bag. And now I decide whether or not I'm going to draw a deep card. Oh, who's kidding? Of course I'm taking this deep card. That's too good. So I'm going to refill the... I'm going to refill that. And... So again... That was optional. As an option, I was allowed to grab that, and then now I do my normal discard and draw, where I'm gonna get rid of that inking, because I don't want it. I'm gonna get rid of that Apex Predator, I don't want it. Then I'm gonna draw two cards. Back up to my hand size of six. Taylor. And also, I should probably turn on turns. Boom. Oh. What happened? It is your turn. Um. Um. OBS hates me. It took your camera off my stream. Oh no! I assure you that I I'm here. Push your camera in the corner. Oh, I need to get that back. I looked over and I was like, "Where? Where are you gone?" <laughs> Ignore the two of my face, chat. There will be <laughs> one of you two. Only one will remain. Hey, now this book was... Yeah! Okay. Okay. okay, you're definitely gonna have to walk me through my first turn. No problem. So I already threw out and locked a board for you, so you, you have your species board there. And now you get to play a card to create your first species. Now, there's not really a wrong answer except for Apex Predator. You shouldn't play Apex Predator because I don't have any fish and it forbids you from being able to forage. So you basically want to play anything but Apex Predator. Okay. And I really hope you don't have six copies of Apex Predator. <laughs> I don't. Is it a? It's a crazy tattooed shark. Yeah, that's Apex Predator. Yeah. Okay, so what? Where do I put said card? Just kind of anywhere on this little board here. Yeah. So I can do this, right? That works. Yep, you are now a whale. You, you Thank have, you, that's very rude. What? 
call me a whale. In the in the awesome take five fish from the reef way. Uh -huh. That's a very strange looking whale, I will be honest. Hey, I think the art in this game looks badass. Oh, it's really cool. I just never saw a whale that was, you know, hunchback. Okay, so I take five fish from the reef. Yes, sir, and they go on your little tracker there. Uh, net, net. You don't start with the uh, the overpopulation square. We're, we'll we'll talk oh, about that square funny. when it happens. Though to be fair, Ooh, as a whale, going. you can't overpopulate. So that is so you yeah, do have yeah. that going for you. I'm gonna I'm gonna I've speed you up your... there. There you go. Now you got your five fish. I've and so here's the thing: every action in the ocean has a consequence. Because you uh, have over three foraging, my whale cleaner uh, happens. So I get to take three fish from the ocean. Because I am a whale cleaner. So I, I, when after you eat all your krill, I swim up to you and I nibble on your delicious beta like bristles. So, so I got a little food out of that. And uh, now you're gonna drop one of your little fishies in your little blue bag. Boom. Okay. So now you make the decision of whether or not you want a deep card over here. Okay. Now, I'm going to tell you that speed is awesome and you want this card. Okay, I just like you. Or... Yep, so just put Last that in your hand. Okay. Yep, that card's yours. And now we're gonna flip over the top uh, deep card to create a new gene pool, and there you go. Okay, so about deep cards. You cannot play deep cards in any way, shape, or form right now. They effectively just clog up your hand. So you want to be very diligent on which ones you grab and which ones you want to use. Okay. And so just kind of keep an eye on the fact that you have that card for now. And now you get to choose whether or not you want to discard any of these cards and draw back up to your hand size of six. Um, I don't know. Um, <laughs> I want to get rid of this. Okay. Here, uh, throw it, throw it right. Not that oh. way. It's in the ocean now. But the discard's right here. You have banished it to the ocean. All right, and then you then you uh, gr pre uh just grab a card. Yeah. It's upside down. Flip over. There you go. That's uh, terrifying. What the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> That's always a good good thing to hear. Some of them are really creepy looking. Ish. Um. Hmm. I do like the under the sea background. It is nice. That's a lot of fish. I am going to create a new species that is an wait an apex predator. Okay. And. For my feeding, I am going to attack with my Apex Predator to take these three fishies from your board. You stole Nemo, you son of a bitch. I, I stole Nemo. Now you have to go find Nemo. 
uh, the, the third movie of the, of the franchise. He was stolen by a man who controlled Apex Predators. Wait, seriously? No, not seriously. <laughs> Good, because I wouldn't watch I that. I would watch that, though. I, I would. That would be amazing. Okay, so I'm I'm going to choose to... to. Yeah, I'm going to choose to look, look here... Gonna take this card. Gonna throw those out. Um, do I? Do I choose to discard it all? Oh wait, I'm I'm already going out of order. I oh. forgot I forgot Hello, to age. I'm already I'm already being a terrible teacher. All right, let's see here. I just still don't know what I'm doing. I'm just looking at fishies. Six. A lot of shark cleaner cards. There we go. Alright, uh, it is now your play cards phase. Huh? Every time I go live, I get like 12 messages in Discord from different people. It's always when I go live, people contact me. It's very annoying. <laughs> What's going on up in here? Well, me and uh, Ninja Necros are looking at fish, pretty much. That's all I've gathered from this game. <laughs> there is fish, and I can pick them up and put them down. And you can play cards. Oh yeah, right. Oops. And so, here's the thing. You can play up to three cards on one species. So... Um, for instance, if you wanted to, for some reason, be Ultra Whale, you could play a second whale and then just always fill up your, your foraging. Or you could create another whale, or you could create something else. It really depends. So can, can I put any card above the whale? This could be any see. card. You can even put doubles if you wanted. Now, here's the thing. You absolutely don't want to do that. Because no. filter feeders can't attack and sharks can't f forage so you basically create a dodo like creature that can't eat <laughs> oh okay, that's not good cool. what is this you actually can't play that yet because it's a deep card okay okay what about this there you go you're a speedy boy whale so that's a good play because you now have a defense of two and a forage of seven. So I can take seven fish? Yeah, you can take seven fish. How many is this? Four fish? <laughs> oh, this is seahorse. Seahorses aren't fish. <laughs> There's no more left. And... If Again. Fish oh yeah, you're gonna you're gonna have to start um, migrating fish or looking at other food supplies. Otherwise, you're gonna run out of the fishies. And uh, I take three fish because I have will cleaner over here. Oh yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna. It's like a mafia deal. It's a you mafia deal. Well, you give us twenty. See how it works. Absolutely. Now you're gonna grab one of your little fishies and you're gonna put it in the bag. The seahorse, my guy, because he's not a fish. Nice. All right. Do you want a deep I have card? Nemo again. And no. Okay. Then discard any surface cards you want, and then uh, draw back up to six. I will get rid of this. This place? Right, that's right. Yeah. How many cards are one, two, two. Yeah, one more. Nice. 
Oh, seriously? No. Um, it is now my turn. I am going to play schooling. So now I have a bunch of schooling little whale cle cleaners. Look at them. They're so adorable. And then for the not adorable, my, my apex predator is going to nom 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 three more fish from your board. Agreed. All right, now for aging. Why do you have two decks? You you can create multiple kinds of fish. I didn't know that. Yes, on your turn you can create um, a new fish. Uh, you're able to have as many species boards as you want. Fish are friends, not food. How do I do that, bro? Um, when you play a card on your turn, you can just create a new board. Just let me know if you want to create a new species on your turn. Okay. Ah, yes. And then I'm going to score two of the fishies off of this species because it's schooling. And I'm going to score a one of the fishies off of my Apex Predator. I am not going to grab a deep card. Going to grab a card. Boom! Your turn. If I just do this. Um, you actually would want to make that as a new species because you can't um, you can't proc off yourself. So uh, here, move that. Where's it going? Boom. There you go. Ugh. Ooh. There we go. You did it! <laughs> I know. It, the, I put it a little too close to your hand. I'm sorry. Uh, Alright. Star is your play. And so now when you, uh, when you forage, mm -hmm. you're going to grab those two fish but you're also going to grab three fish from the ocean here and put it on your board. The fish blend in. Oh, those oh, three fish. Where's um fish? Yeah, those go over here. And then you'd grab three from there. Yeah. Why are they all You got to you got to move them. There you go. God. Now you're going to grab three fish Refresh. We're professionals. And that's going over there. Yeah. Stop grabbing those a hole. I'm not doing it. No, I am. I keep grabbing them into the hole. Nice. Oh, then I put a fish in my bag, right? Yep, you're gonna grab one fish from here and put it in your bag. You're gonna grab one fish from here and put it in your bag. I'm securing my Nemo so you don't take them this time. You gotta pro you gotta protect those Nemos. So they don't get lost. Okay. Deep card. Yes ha, or no. Ha, 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 Chris. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, I, I, I know. Stop clown fishing around, yeah. Chris is pulling out all of the ocean dad jokes right now. Father Jay, my, first time Father Jay was in my stream. Hello, welcome. Hey, I'm only here to throw up with an AC of 24. Well, the thing is, I'm we're playing room. a game Talk about, about fish. Is is ACs after last night are triggering. Oh, I know, right? Is we're playing about yeah. we're playing a game right. about fish, you know? So. Naturally, he got it. He had to jump on that our fishing boat and come out here. Exactly. I'm still upset over last night. What did you get? Whomped or something? X roll is tough, man. 
See, I'm I'm purposefully like not allowed to to, to watch X Crawl right now because I'm going to be participating oh, in a couple weeks. Week? Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. That was me last last yeah last time. Just I'm just gonna say. Prepare don't, yourself. Don't mentally. say shit. Just my my oh, mentally. Don't worry. You'll get my, angry. My you'll, body you is will ready. Get angry. Oh my god, I'm actually I got so stressed by the end. Of it. Do you want a deep card? I do. All right. Do you I'm want it from one of the a mini rant? <laughs> do, do you want it from the gene pools or do you want it from the deck? I want this thing. Okay. Uh, you just picked up two cards, unfortunately. Here. Yeah. Um. Yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah. was hiding. There you go. Take that. It's, it's not safe to go alone. Take this. Okay. I just took the it is a whale of a question, isn't it? Um, all right, discard and draw. Do you, you want to get rid of any of those? I do, because I've got 50 of these. All right. Don't worry, I still have about 12 of them. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Are you pulling every transparent in the deck or something? No, it wasn't that. I just, I just keep getting duplicates. It's oh, all man. the same card, but... Oh, it's very annoying. Okay. Choices. Choices, choices. All right, let's th let, let's throw a total wrench into like into the the ecosystem. My apex predator is now also a whale cleaner. Which wait no, that's a terrible play. Um, it's now inking. I just realized that 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 would dick out my other that would dick out my other uh, whale cleaner. That would be a terrible idea. The fish puns are painful. Okay. Inks in Denmark? So, unfortunately, you have defense too, so I only get to take one fishy from your board this time. Ha! Get fucked. You ain't gonna my fucking fishy. And now I score two fish. I score one fish. I am not going to take a deep card, but I will take a surface card. And now it is your turn again. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Fuck off, Chris, with your shitty puns. Okay. He just can't kelp himself. Ah! No, that hurt. That nah, that was painful. Okay. My favorite fish is the octopuns. Uh, that one wasn't even good. Don't congratulate yourself for that one. <laughs> Can I do this? It, no, you cannot yet. Uh, Almost. We are so close. So the rule is you can't play deep cards until the Cambrian explosion happens, and that's gonna happen when these four fish go away. So here's so here's the big brain play. If you have a if you have if one of these cards has a number greater than four, then you can move these fish away and then play another card because the deep uh because the Cambrian explosion has happened. Then you could play Colossus. Okay. I don't have anything higher than four. Can I do this? Well, well, um, you could do that, but if you played this uh, as a migration, what I'm saying is you could move these four fish, like here, and then oh. you could play, then you could play Colossus. All right, boom, the Cambrian explosion has happened. So 
in order to play a migration card, you're going to have to sacrifice four of your fishies from your bag to the reef. I'll do it. Oh, it's not what I meant to do. <laughs> um. Oh. That's that's a way to do it. <laughs> and here they go. All right, you're you're now a a speedy colossal filter feeder. Oh wow! Now I just outright can't attack your whale. Okay. Yep. On on the bright side, you are gonna have a very hard time keeping yourself fed. All right, so you have played your two cards. Um, and you can make your typical like feeding. However. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. Here's, <laughs> here's the rule now. Aging is plus one. Every species by default is going to age by two now. So that's something to keep in mind. So you're, you're going to do your, uh, your feeding, right? Mm -hmm. All right. So... There are eight fish in the reef. However, I don't think you have room for other fish, no. So you basically just fill up your board. That's too many. Okay. Oh God. Oh, um, no, you can keep that one. It's just you don't overpopulate because you're a whale. So the bad thing that happens oh. doesn't happen. Oh, there are so many things I play on tabletop sim Legi or uh, me. I mean, Liching Hour. Uh... <laughs> hey, Nor really think was talking to people, talking to yourself is a sign of genius. So I've heard at least that's what the voice in my head says. Um. No, Lich, I play so many things on, on tabletop sim. I'll play pretty much anything. We're going to be playing um, Declare Yourself, which is a reskin of Sherbert Nottingham soon, I hope. Oh, that'll be fun. It, do, it does have fun. And I want to play Monopoly at some point. The classic. Okay. So, here's the thing. The rule abundance now happens. So because you fed, instead we each take four fish from the ocean. So okay. So your little your little whale guy is little whale feeder is going to get uh four fish. And my species is starting to get a little fat here. <laughs> So, four fish to where? You're gonna grab four fish from here, and you're gonna put it on your little whale cleaner guy. Yeah! Almost. I was taking a sip of my drink, so I just said, fuck it, fish will go in this direction. And now, two fish from each board go in your score. Um, oh, oh yeah, man. I'd be down to play Scythe. I'd be down to play some co-op games. Um, in general, I love, I love tabletop sim. I even found a, uh, a version of Betrayal or House on Haunted Hill, but it's Scooby-Doo. So it's far more, um, not rage-inducing. I want to do that. That's fun. Yeah. <laughs> But, um, Lich, if everything goes to plan, we should be doing board games every Friday, right? That was the idea. That's the idea. We'll try to be playing uh, board games okay. at about this time. Um, next time we play Oceans, I'll try and get a few of my friends in on it from, from your time zone. Hopefully we don't have the same OBS issues we did in there. Oh yeah, we had we had a, a laugh and a half getting OBS going this morning. Yeah, right. yeah, we did. 
Okay, so now that you can play deep cards, you kind of have a better incentive to um, think about grabbing deep cards. Um, not quite. So you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna pull those out there, and you're gonna press Alt Shift to peek at them, and you can peek at all three of them. You, and the one you like the most, take it into your hand. Oh, almost. Okay, so now these get flipped up and they get put on these gene pools. So what's the order that you want these put on the gene pools? Um, do you want hmm. do you want hard shell to be here or here? Uh, here you go. Uh -huh. Awesome. What's the big fish? Um, that's a little like reserve pile that I can pull from when the game's over. Because huh. um, here's how the game ends: when the ocean is completely empty, uh. The, the end of the game begins. Okay. And and then it it ends very quickly, by the way. So that's that's something to keep in mind. Okay. So um now you discard and draw. There's so sixty fish in the ocean till the game ends. <laughs> How did I fuck up, Lich? Do I have to discard? No, it's completely optional. I mean, I still want to, but... Yeah. Oh, he's... Oh, wow. Lichigar is calling you out of my stream. What's he saying? It says, ANSWER HIM! <laughs> all else. right it's all good oh, i tapped out oops <laughs> oh don't don't leave me we have so many poop jokes to make okay so now because it's my it, it's because it's the cambrian period i get to play two cards um the problem is uh I don't really like these cards. Um, What's this saying to me? Eh. Said you're a Cambrian period. Say it to my face, bitch. <laughs> okay, you... Um, you know what? Uh, I'm gonna big brain play this. I'm going to play two cards as migrations. How many fish are in here? All of these fish are going to the reef. All of them. Pack your bags. Pack your bags, fishies. You're going to the reef. And now genetic diversity is turned on. We can now have four traits on each of our species. So our, our maximum is now four cards on each on each species. Though it is worth noting that speed is like an extra card, so you could put two more cards on the species if you wanted. Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I played my two cards. Um, well, I, I guess the only thing I could do is is eat three of your whale cleaner fish. Nom 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 nom. All right. Whoop, aging. So I score two of the fishy, and I score. Three of the fishy. And a, uh, a nice 
OBS and Discord crash. Oh no, did you just did you just crash? Yeah. Oh not still the game. But OBS and Discord went poof. Not from Charlie Brown. Uh there is actually a prehensile tail in this game. It's like a a disc card you can play on someone. It um it messes with their their stuff. <sighs> okay, so Discord is open, but it's not open. Discord. I can hear you on the chat song, but Discord isn't actually open on my computer. Like it's not running. That's not good. Why do streams hate? Flip of thumbs. Well, well, well. Chill out's trying to figure out his thing. Let's just look at how beautiful the art is in this game. Man, they tapped some amazing artists for this game. Thank you for stopping by. We're we're going to eat at the fishies. He's, He's lurking in the shadows. Here we go. And then back. Stream is back on. This code is open to my the face. This good isn't gonna get it, I think, so. Off you go. Is it my guy? No, I don't see your face yet. Don't see my face? That makes sense because my camera's not on because I have OBS. Alright. It is now your turn. I'm sick of doing the play. Okay. So, wait, what happened to my card? Oh, it's just right here. It, it's still there. I, I um, can you afford the fish for that card? Oh, uh, do you have at least two fish in your bag? I have five. Oh, then yeah, you can. Well, you don't actually want to tell me your score there, but yeah, then then pull out two fish from your bag to to play that card. Just right here. Mm -hmm. Alright, and then, yeah, slam that card down. Yell reverse Uno and slam the card down. Alright, you are a very speedy whale boy. That is a colossus. There is a colossal speeding whale. Just. I. Maybe that's what the currents are, is they're just evidence that a colossal whale was just speeding through the ocean and permanently messed it up. That's my creation myth. 
All right, you can play another card if you want. Oh, I can. <laughs> that works. Speedy way, you teenagers. Speedy boys. All right. Um. Uh, so. Now you basically fill yourself up from the reef. You fill your whale up from the reef. <laughs> I mean, I'm running just one fish. Now. That's two fish. All right, now you grab. Uh, oh, story. Now you grab four fish from the ocean oh. for your whale cleaner. My fish. These are my fish! Go get your own fish! Oh what the fuck? Oh. <laughs> yeah, can you not torch my side of the field, please? I didn't think that would pick up every single thing that was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it could be worse, I could have thrown it off the table. Oh, we're gonna get by so great in cooperative games there, chill out. Yes, yes we are. <laughs> okay, so now I wanna make it so I have six characters. Also, now I have to... Oh, can I not eat that? What is this? Ooh. Anything there? What happened? Oh, I was just checking something. Okay. Your turn. Um, did you remember to score your two fish from each, uh, each species? Totally. Did I, did I miss? Yeah. Yeah, you did it again. Oh, look. I, I, I love the fish they did up for this uh, mod, though. They are very cool looking. Okay. Although, again, the sea fish is not a fish. The sea fish, the seahorse is not a fish. Um... I create a um monstrosity. Oh. I'm gonna spend also three fish to turn my apex predator into an inking swole boy. He is now a Leviathan. Not an elder oh, god. <laughs> there, there is like a Cthulhu card over here. Yeah, I saw. Really nice. I am obviously very tired. Okay, so that puts oh, my. Like yeah, speaking of, I'm s I still don't have enough s enough power to actually like catch your giant speeding whale. Um, that's a lot of attack power that I need for that. Um, however, My whale is a submarine. It is. However, I can I can nom on your your filter feeders in order to propagate my shark cleaners. For now. And now, four or three fishy. My turn. Is it my turn? Is it my turn? Or my... Four or three fishy, or two fishy. And now, uh, 
I'm going to take that card. That card. Boom. It is now your turn. Okay. Boom. Aw, oh, you got tired of me eating you. <laughs> Indeed. That's rude. So now I fill up my whale. Um, do you want to play another card? You have room. Oh yeah, I can. Do I have to put it in the extra traits place? Yep. But you can. Okay. What this? Sure. Because uh, that's going to make it so when you age, you take another fish from your board there. And since we and since we gained so much, you're you're going to want to score that extra fish anyway. So it's a pretty good idea. Okay, so two fish from here for the whale. Yes, and then each of us uh, are going to gain four, as as per tradition. However, I do something bad i overpopulate how many do i do first how many do i take you're, you're gonna my... take four fish for here four. from from the ocean from not from the reef from the ocean oh, I, from I, the I, deep I <laughs> there you go so i overpopulated and what that means is I filled up my board and when you do that you basically take all but five fish from your board and you throw it back out in the reef so you don't do that because you're a whale whales are big chonky boys so you are going to age though I'm an old whale yeah the elder whale I do put two in here, right? Yep, you grab two from there, and you're going to grab three from here. Nice. Do you want a deep card? I'll take a deep card. Oh, oh, I pressed buttons. I'm going to steal the Cthulhu. Alrighty. Oops. That's a card I should have grabbed earlier. Yes, yes, it is. <laughs> All right, discard and draw. You want to discard anything? card excellent all right i'm going to huck inking we no longer spray ink because we now have quite an upgrade huh? yes it is and then I'm going to migrate. I'm going to take nine fish and a seahorse. And I'm going to put it. Wait. There we go. In the reef. Why do some fish turn upside down? Um, just press F to flip them back over. <laughs> I just flip my fish. Baby the fishes. Alright. Yeah, don't flip my cards. <laughs> Aha! This, oh, this, man, this man causing chaos over in my side of the board. Magic.
Oh man. You really need to stop messing with my side of the board during my turn. <laughs> I didn't do anything, I just did this. Alright, I'm gonna take too much. I can't do it to my room. I don't want it. You have it. Your turn. <laughs> There's too much to distract me in this game. Can I remove cards from the like, here? Yeah, you can. You can just unevolve cards when you when you want. Um, you already, you, you already have, like, um, like, that's not going to allow you to play that card. You'd have to get rid of one of these other cards. And, um, well, actually, no, you have room for it. You could just put it there. What, like, here? Yeah, yeah, you have room for it. So, yeah, boom, you're parasitic. So, if I'm not mistaken... That lets you take these two fish from my my board. What's up? Nope, from this one. Oh, you had Nemo and Dory. How cool! There you go, friends. And then I also take my normal amount of fish, right? Yeah. Let's fill up here. And uh, take. Three from here? If I'm a four. Four. There we go. And then I pull two from here and then three from the other one. Come back. There. Did I win? Did you score your fish? Yeah. Ready. Oh, right. Uh, do I want to draw a special pet? No, I don't. I'm just going to draw another one. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Do you have a score bag, or can other people just not see it? I have one. It's just you can't look at my score. Interesting. this hmm okay so I'm gonna play the card as a migration. Move these over there. So that begins the end of the game. Finding all these fun features. <laughs> okay, your turn. Oh, right. Oops. Yes.
So technically, if I do, if I remove something, do I have to discard it? Yeah. Can I play something somewhere? Am I missing something? Oh, I should be able to play something on my way though, right? Because I have one extra trait with the second speed. Yeah, you still have one room there. Yeah. So now I can play another one, right? Because that's what gives me another extra trait. Yep. Next turn, I mean. Oh, you can play two cards. Oh. <laughs> Here you go. Why is that this way? <laughs> Three copies of speed. There you go, he's so fucking quick. <laughs> there you go, so then... I do, I want to fill up my... And what happened to all the ocean fish? They look so weird. They, they got moved. I just realized I don't do that anymore. <laughs> it's not a sh that's not a wheel cleaner. Oh, and I get to take with my parasite. I get to take. Oh yeah, here here you go. Take my two fish. Oh no, I overpopulate. Ah yes, you overpopulate. So so you're gonna throw um you're gonna throw five of these fish back to the reef. Aging. Yeah. All right, and now the game is over. As yeah, as. We have evolved, and and it is now the end of our saga. So I'm going to pull my little bonus token out here. And my score is 30... Wait, hold on. Also, um... So, grab your little blue bag and pull it out. No, no, your blue bag, the whole thing. I did, I did, I did this, and then this. All right. Now throw throw all your little fish in here, all of them. Oh wow, this is a closer closer game than I thought. <laughs> thirty-eight to thirty-two. Okay, I'm pretty happy with what I did for that first game. But I win. <laughs> Just pocket the whole reef. <laughs> Scoreception. <laughs> that shouldn't be a thing. Oh yeah, you can you can Matrushka bags if you want. Fish go everywhere. What the fuck's this? Where'd this come from? Oh a turn why is it turn into a question mark? Because it's uh, it's it's someone's hand. Oh, that's so cool. So wait, do you see a load of question marks here? For yes, many of them. <laughs> Look, I made a group of fish. Oh. It was about time. All right. Wait, is that just gonna instantly keep falling? Well, that was oceans. Yeah, did you fun. have fun? I did actually. That was quite fun. It was quite enjoyable. Hell yeah!
So the deal with this no. game is it was uh, made by the dude that made the Evolution series of games. And I kind of prefer this to Evolution because in Evolution you can directly destroy other people's species where you can't really do that in this game. Um, there are promo cards that let you do that, but uh, we didn't play with those. Um, all in all, uh, good game. Uh, this game really opens up with multiple people. It's wacky. I see. Under the sea. Under, Under the, the sea. sea. I love how you created it. You literally just called us at the end of the game. <laughs> Great timing. Alright, do you think that's uh, that's it for you, Chill Out? I don't know. I mean, I could do something, I guess. You sound so tired, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I am very tired. Oh, yeah, yeah, Necro! Oh, yeah! We'll play yeah, another I game! Can do <laughs> Your face, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I could do something. I mean, I'm not gonna go to bed. I'm, I'll probably end up streaming Stardew Valley or some shit. <laughs> right on. Then, uh, then I think that wraps wraps up our stream. Do we? Let, let's see here. Who am I rating a new? Ooh, Raid's here! Raid! What's with my voice? What do you mean, what's with my voice? What's that supposed to mean? There's two people in this stream. <laughs> my Why name is Sillout Corner, and I like to tag people's cars. Totally not true. Why? I don't understand. Why, like, I had both of I'm not using that so much, it's really annoying. There we go. Here, I don't... I have no idea what the hell these guys are playing, but we're raiding into them. Well, I'll have a look, see who's up. I'm actually mean and not waiting for someone. I mean, I, I think I'm actually have one person watching this one. It's gonna be... Me. All right, let's let's like be really nice to these guys and like spam all sorts of like friendly emotes and such. I could raid into Bob Ross. Okay. Oh,